I guess, corner, review, gameplay, a little bit of both, column A, column B, column C. Today we are looking at Attack from Mars, again from the wonderful world of Pinball Arcade for the PS4. Um, Attack from Mars is a 1995 pinball game designed by Brian Eddy, released by Midway under the Bali label. In this game, Martians begin to invade Earth. It's up to the player to destroy the Martian fleet, save all major cities, and head off to Mars to destroy the Martian Empire that, and conquer Mars. Along with the game's notes, features including four dancing Martian figures, strobe lights, and a strobe multi-ball. There's been a sequel to the game called Revenge to Mars, which is pretty cool. It's a little 3D digital version. But nonetheless, as you can see, I've already kind of started playing the game. Um, <laughs> I'm uh, actually doing really, really well. Um, so we're just going to watch some of the gameplay here. You know, the whole goal is to, again, shoot the middle there, blow up the... Bam. Boom. Just like that. Blow up the alien ship after you drop their shields. Blow it up, get away the Mars, and win. As you see, that's the first one I did, so let's uh, keep going here. I see I can change. you can change the ball here in uh, the pinball arcade. I made it a little happy face, a little uh, keep cool happy face. Um, there's another version of this one where... Um, um, okay, so there's another one where it's actually a digital one where it's actually hologrammed. So you gotta shoot the thing in the middle, the aliens are more in the middle, it's a hologram cool. thing, uh, more interactive. Got a big so that was pretty cool. Um, to get your times bonus, all you gotta do is line up the two, the left and right one. Really easy to see how on times 12 to 13. Um, super jets, you start at 100, keep popping them until you get to zero. Um, to get the jackpots forward every way. And you get yourself some jackpots. Super dead. Uh, I just knocked the um, shield down. We must save the Brandenburg at four. Save me, save Get some me. combos here. Three-way combo. Combo breaker. Four-way combo. Boom. And the last one off. You're the best. Boom, look at that. See? Yeah, that's a lot. Four billion. Trillion. Quadrillion. That's a lot to get for a free game. So I don't think we'll be doing that today the here. Martians but uh, as you can see, Germany. you know, you want to destroy the saucers. Once destroy you get their energy the down to zero, as you can see, you need to get the ball down the middle to blow them up. So... Each one of them takes a different amount, the higher you get up. And the extra ball. In the face. Boom! Headshot. Oh, look at Two and a half away. If you spell Martian, those Martians start to dance. Dancing Martians are always fun. Oh, sh oh, sh we gotta save the Statue of Liberty. Take that, Martians! Now we're battling for the Statue of Liberty. Get up there. That one sucks things up. Um, out of the city, like hot dog carts and stuff. Oh, oh. And oh, oh, okay. Lock them out. Get the troops ready. Video mode. Now this goes back to people who played the old Atari. If you played the Atari, you know this game. Oh. 
No, the music's pretty fun in this game. A little repetitive, um, kind of breaks it up with some other action music, but it's pretty good considering if you're thinking more of a video game. Go at it, the music's pretty cool. The animations on the screen are pretty fun. Um, oh, oh, I didn't even notice I had multi-ball. Shoot! Oh, drop it, losing them. Sorry guys. So how many people have played this game before? There you go, boom. And an extra ball. Extra ball! Have you played this version? Have you played the uh, the digitalish version? Have you played the real one? Um, you know, I am pretty pleased, you know, these games are fun. Um, they do a really good job. Uh, and capturing the table's feel, that's for sure. Mars, but uh, we're not as a team. Sh you can shake the table. You can get a tilt, which you'll lose all your points. Um, so not recommended. Um, you get a nice, good view there of a couple of the top things. Oh, here's the dancing things. Now I would think if you had this in your home, these are really loud. And even in the game, they made this loud. <laughs> it's like the most annoying part of playing this live is these stupid jumping things. That's what I think anyways, and I, you know, Run away. if you agree with me, let me know what you think in the comments, for sure. <laughs> Somebody shoot one of those things. shield was up so I was unable to, to do what was needed
still have a ball stuck up there. There it is. Oh, oh, damn it. At least I got the jackpot. You passed ahead. No. Oh, there goes the puppy. You know, and one thing I find about the game is that the uh, everything is really bang on. Uh, the controls are really good. Uh, Gameplay is fun. Um, I would give the controls probably a high, a high mark. Um, the just this table alone, this table's pretty fun. Uh, getting the high Get scores, doing everything you need, you know, like in this sense, has been fantastic. Um, I've never, I gotta say, say um. <laughs> but uh, no, there we go. Look at that, I finally lost that ball. Now I can use all my, uh, my extra balls. Do it again! Remember how I said I wasn't gonna get the, the free game? And I did. Because I'm fantastic. I bust your face and your ugly mouth. But uh, the funness of this table, I give about an eight because it can be very frustrating uh, when you are a beginner at this table. There are some things that are some cheap, cheap deaths with it, so you do have to be very careful. Um, I would r highly recommend that you learn. To use the table bump. I haven't used the table bump a lot in this because I don't need to. When I have, it's been very, there you go. It's been very uh, easy. But for the most part, you want to make sure you're using the table bump because if you don't use the table bump, you're going to lose your balls a lot, especially when it shoots out of there. Uh, and if it goes up a ramp and comes back down, those are some very hard aspects to, to pay attention. But on the right side, if it bounces over there like that on the left, there's no stopping it. And those are the ones I find are the cheap, 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 cheap. So. Do it again! Like that. All saved. But nonetheless, I would give this table overall, I would probably give just this table a about a 9 out of 10. Um, again, reason being, it's a fun table. It is a lot to do, a lot to complete, and just keeps you going. You know, you just want to do that much better. So, there you have it. Please check us out at www.theconflictsocial.com for all your gaming needs. My name is Kaztec. And yeah, game on, folks. If you can beat me, you let me know.